Julia, second pursuit win in a row for you, and you seemed pretty calm and focused today. How did you see your race? Uh, yeah, it was a good race, of course. Um, uh, I think uh, I need to shoot, uh, to shoot clean for uh, for good races, and uh, I only won mistakes. So, so yeah, it's a. Uh, it was a good uh, good race and I'm really happy. It feels uh, really crazy to race with the yellow bib and the uh, win with this yellow bib is just something amazing. That is exactly the thing. You started for the first time in your career in yellow bib. How did it feel and did it put any pressure on you? Yes, a little <laughs> bit. <laughs> yeah, I feel uh, nervous, nervous at the beginning of the race, uh, but it was a good stress. It was, uh, I want to go, <laughs> I want to go and, uh, and push uh, as hard as I can, but uh, yeah, I need to, to focus on myself and uh, stay calm at the, at the start. And uh, yeah, I'm really proud of this race. Uh, now uh, it's clear that you're going to keep the yellow bib for your home ANSI uh, event where all tickets are sold out with so many fans. So do you think it's going to be for your joy or will also put a little bit of pressure to be in front of your fans in yellow? Ah, maybe both. <laughs> yeah, it's. Uh, I think it's going to be something crazy to race at home with the yellow bib. Friends, family, everyone will be there. So yeah, yeah. Uh, for now, I, I enjoy it <laughs> and uh, I don't uh, think about that. But uh, yeah, I think it's something uh, really crazy to live in uh, in my athlete life. So I will enjoy a lot uh, this moment. Enjoy it. Thank you so much. Thanks. Perfect competition for you today, climbing from 13 to second. Uh, how did you do it? <laughs> oh, well, uh, if I knew the, what I would do next time, <laughs> it would be really good. But um, yeah, today I just tried to have fun in the course and be calm in the shooting. So I was um, not my best uh, on the sprint. And also like uh, today on the zeroing, I was uh, my head was somewhere else. And um, uh, Siegfried and Patrick was like, uh, Ingrid, now you need to get your shit together uh, because it was um, it was terrible. But I managed to be concentrated in the race, and yeah, it was it was a great day. For the final lap, you will uh, you were leaving uh, right behind Marquetta. So, uh, what was your plan? How did you see this final lap for yourself? Um, Actually, my plan was to stay behind uh, and wait for the Venus sprint, but uh, I guess the plan just, uh, I had to put in the garbage and my head wanted something else. I, I knew I was fighting for the podium, but I also knew that Denise was uh, behind, so I didn't want to, to wait before I tried to uh, push the last uh, push, um, because uh, she's a really good uh, finisher. So I just had to uh, yeah, use all my power. And when I heard I, I got some meters on Marquetta, then uh, I got some extra power. <laughs> uh, you showed one of the uh, best skiing times today. Um, and your ski skiing uh, has improved. Uh, what did you change? What did you do? Maybe something in your technique? Uh, yeah, I, I really tried to, to work hard to improve my technique to be more efficient. Uh, and. Uh, uh, it's not working as good every time, like on Thursday, but today when I can go with people and just relax and, and uh, try to, to maximize the speed, it's, um, uh, I think it works really well. And also, um, I had uh, amazing skis today. It was like, uh, I think I had the best skis in the, in the whole pursuit. So it was a good feeling. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Marketa, congratulations. Another podium for you here in Hochfeld. And how would you rate your performance? Yeah, I'm, I'm really happy. I think it's, this is my best pursuit result. So, so I think it's, it's really good for me. <laughs> um, Ingrid was pushing really hard on the final lap behind you. Can you tell a little bit more about this final lap? Yeah, I think she's really fighter. <laughs> so so she, she was better. So I, I, I don't have a power to fight with her. So. Yeah. <laughs> now you're quite consistent, you're in top five, so what are you now plans uh, for going uh, to ANSI, what you think about? Uh, actually, I don't know, I'm so tired today, so I need to recover a little bit and then I will think about it maybe next week. <laughs> Thank you so much, congratulations. Okay.